dumb, unsophisticated people sit around their kitchen tables and make fun of things they don't understand. They make fun of Black Lives Matter because they're like, I don't get it. All cops are good guys. No, they're not. They're good to you because you're white. Your cousin Vinny's on the force. So you didn't get thrown in the drunk tank when you came home in a DWI. You know, there's something that's never talked about. White folks get get out of jail free cards. If you grew up, especially where I do in New York and you know somebody who's a cop, they give you their PBA card, you know, or their business card. And you're allowed to show that to a cop that pulls you over and it gets you out of that infraction. That's an unspoken thing that's gone on for decades in white America. They don't give them out to black people, you know? And I've been in cars where dudes use those cards and I was like, please pull them over. You know, like he's drunk and I'm a passenger, like just take this guy to, and and I had a guy get let go. We were in Jersey on Route 17 and then he got pulled over again. And I used to drink <laughs> back then too. I was, he got pulled over twice. And the second guy was like, no, you know, the card doesn't work. <laughs> like you're going to jail, buddy. And I was like, thank God, you know, cause I'm like, like, you know, it was insane, but that's that's America. But the people that grow up in that, that are protected by it, they don't want to challenge it. Why would I challenge it? You know, don't break the law and you won't get in trouble. You know, that is not true at all. These people get shot in the back. And police brutality is rampant in this country. But people don't understand that, you know, and Trump was able to, he instinctually knows those marks are out there. He knows America's full of these people and Fox News has primed them for decades. So their brains are just completely malleable and they, they get the right trigger words, the left, socialism, communism, like all this kind of things that just make them be like, whoa, we have to fight against that. How do I do that? You put this Punisher sticker on the back of your pickup truck and this flag, you know, and you get a 48 ounce Mountain Dew and you head down to the local arena and Marjorie Taylor Greene and Matt Gates are gonna tell you how you fight against socialism to save America, right? People are buying it. <laughs> 